goal as a forgotten saving. How does this work? Let me explain. Hi there friends, thank you so much for watching this video. My name is Naresh, your goal buddy, and I'm also the author of the book, The Secrets of Bonafide Money Revealed. Many people are aware of the need to have savings. In fact, many people also know about this 50, 30, 20 rule on how we can allocate our salary for these allocations. But how many of us are actually doing this? And in terms of savings, many people also know they need to save their money and they end up saving the money in the form of cash. Saving money in cash is still a good thing. However, the longer we keep our money in the bank, what happens is that the value of our money is crashing. And this is what happens to our Malaysian Ringgit whereby it has dropped to the lowest point over 26 years time. And this is not only true for Ringgit. The same pattern will happen to across all the currencies in the world. Therefore, we need to park our money in a safer place. Apart from inflation, people who keep their money in the bank, especially for the long-term savings and long-term investment, they ended up investing their money into other places where they don't have the know-how, they don't know how it works, it's not part of their circle of competence, and they ended up losing the money. Just recently, I read a news that about 6 million ringgit is gone in a gold-related scam. So people who have lost their money, where can they turn to? Therefore, before we start putting our money, before we park our money in a place, make sure you understand how that particular program works. By the way, if you like this kind of content, consider following me on TikTok and save this video as favorites for your future reference. This is where I would like to introduce to you the concept of forgotten saving. That means every month you get your salary, you quickly allocate a portion of your salary in the form of gold and then you continue with your life. And during times where you need some cash, then you can reflect looking at your gold account and use the gold to your advantage. This is what we ought to do if our intention is to pack our money for the long term. As we begin our gold savings and gold investment, we must have an objective. Like for example, let's say you want to uh, own 100 grams of gold in 4 years time. So this is a good objective. So now that you know you want to achieve 100 grams of gold in 4 years time, how to execute? So what you do, you take 100, you divide it by 4. When you divide by 4, each year you need to accumulate at least 25 grams of gold. Correct? And that 25 grams of gold, when you divide by 12, that means you need to buy at least 2 grams of gold of every month. So this is the kind of strategy that we should follow if we have an objective in our mind, especially in gold savings and gold investment. Thanks to Public Gold, we have a very easy method known as Gold Accumulation Program, whereby as the name implies, we are going to put our deposits in this account and depending on the gold rate of the day, the deposit will be converted into grams of gold. And as we do this consistently, the value of gold will increase over time and the amount, the volume also will increase over time. So sometime in the future, when you choose to sell your gold, you will be selling in a higher profit at a higher rate and hence you are going to make more money. If you are interested to start your own gold reserve whereby you want to build your own fund manager, let me know, drop me a message and I will show you step by step on how to get started. With the right know-how, losing money is very difficult. I shall be talking to you very soon.